we really just cut that whole thing out like that. All you need is an X-Acto knife, maybe one of these to lay it flat, some 409, and it's a proven hack. What's good, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Jazz. Today, we're going to be doing a DIY project. So as you guys may know from previous videos, if you guys watch me, I happened to fail my inspection, which basically was because I had an airbag light on and because of my tent. Now to me, this is very strange because I had this tent for two years. So I think this is like a new law now, but I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. So they're stating because my brake light now, now it looks really dark, certain days it's sunny. I guess this part of the brake light you can't see and that's why I failed. So what we're gonna do is try to get a product to basically just cut this section off and be careful because of the defrosters. You don't wanna mess that up with your car. So me looking on YouTube, I went to see if somebody can do that, them, um, you know, to pay somebody to do it. And they were charging like hundreds to $200 to take either the little part off or the whole part off. And then I have to get tent put back on, which I don't want to do. So me and my dad are going to try to DIY it. And we saw some stuff online where basically we use a degreaser, a trash bag, and some tape maybe i think that's pretty much it and you should be able the way we do it to peel it off so we're gonna test this out today and see right now i'm about to head to walmart and see if i can get some degreaser and see what we can do okay this is the one i picked up they said any kind of one that removes the grease and stuff will work well so we'll test this one out and see how good it works okay we're gonna see if we can take part of that off to get to the brake light to make it a little bit easier and see but we're not for sure we're just gonna try a little bit and see what we can do but I'll update you once we get off or figure out what we're really gonna do with it. So we got that out, here's what it's looking like. And like we were saying, see the light is in the whole, uh, what is it, the panel? Back dash. Back dash. You guys know what it is. So if you're gonna see, we're gonna try to get underneath that whole part and not touch any of this wiring here like that. All right, I'm trying to stick my camera in here, but we got it taped up the best we can show from the inside. And then we're just going to spray it and put the garbage bag on it and let it sit. It looks like it's on as good as it's gonna be, if you can see. I can't get it completely straight, but that should be enough, I think. All right, I don't know if you can see, I tried to tape it up a little bit better. So you can see I have a smaller piece of the bag on to help it with just the tape to kind of hold it in place. And I'm gonna let that sit. I parked facing the sun so the sun can beam directly on that part a little bit better and spray some more to make sure I get it in really good. So I'm gonna let it sit for like 10 minutes and then we'll see how it works. This was a whole job. If you can see how scrunched up I am inside this car trying to do this, me and my dad did it together. So sorry if some pieces are a little bit off. If you guys might have questions, leave it in the comments below and I can let you know I can ask my dad too because we kind of were going on and off like back and forth helping each other do it. But as you can see, I got my whole legs in the trunk and everything. But I think it's gonna work, so let's see, hopefully. So it's been about 10 minutes. I'm gonna peel it off and see what happens. I'm not quite sure, but it won't hurt to peel off and see. Can you see it? Look at that. I don't know, I'm sorry, I'm trying to get you guys to see it. Give me a sec. There we go, it's a little bit better. You see it now? Just peel it off slow. All that's coming right off. We just gotta score it a little bit like that. You can see. See? Came right off. I think what you got 
right there. Yeah. I think I can cut that though to see it like a, a line like that. I don't yeah. know if they can see it on there. That's the only thing. I'm not gonna worry about this too much because I don't really want to mess that up, honestly. But it's a little bit underneath. Yeah. That should be good. Wow, that was really easy. You saw how it peeled right off? I might have some bubbles eventually, yes, I feel it. Yeah. that whole thing out like that. That's where the brake light's gonna be. All you need is an X-Acto knife. Maybe one of these to lay it flat. Some 409 and it's a proven hack. I'm gonna clean it up a little bit and we'll pop this back in and see how it looks. All right, everything's put back in place. As you can see, we're gonna give you a little brake test so you guys can see. And there you go. Yep, so everything looks good. All right, y'all. I forgot I went to the gym. And then I went to get my car reinspected. And as you can see, they said this part right here, they wanted it to be a little bit higher. Even though that's right by the defrost line. When you put the brake on, you can still see it there. When it, Like the brake light, you can see it. But they said they're going to want it a little bit higher there. I can see a little bit what they're talking about now like the shape of it but you can still see light through it but that didn't matter because as you can see let me move my base sticker i still got approved so either way it's still gonna work out now they did accept everything that happened because like i said i got my airbag light taken care of and then we did that he said he wasn't too worried about it just the next year somebody else if we go there somebody else they might want it a little bit higher now that i actually stepped out and saw it too i can't see the part they're talking about but we're gonna cross that bridge when we get there we'll see what they somebody else says later like next year but i think it should be fine but as you can see it's a quick hack that can save you hundreds of dollars i'm sweating it's so hot outside guys but i wanted to get this out for you guys so you can see quick and easy hack all you need like i said is probably tape just to hold it up trash bag uh zacto knife or scissors or something like that with a pointy edge that you can like kind of like score it a little bit and then what was the last thing and maybe like a credit card or an id just to make it smoother it's not necessary you can use your hands it works just as good but as you can tell it was definitely a good hack you guys can leave a comment and let me know if you like these diys and stuff and if you tried it, if it works for you if you have any questions you can also leave a comment below i gotta get out this heat so that's gonna wrap this video make sure you like share comment subscribe be back on the next one oh!